Hello, welcome back to Tips and Time Savers. My name is Danny Rocks. Has this ever happened to you? Your boss has asked you to take the data that you have in column A and insert it in between columns C and D. And oh, by the way, take the information that's in column F and put that in between columns B and C. Well, you could cut and paste insert columns, but let me demonstrate a better way to do it. Rearrange your data by sorting across columns. When we think of sorting, we tend to think of sorting records in a column. In this case, we have our records for our students arranged in alphabetical order in ascending. To change it to descending order, it's a simple matter. Or to change our scores to have them ranked from top to bottom. Did you know that you can sort across columns from left to right? Let me demonstrate. Here with a simple address book, our boss has asked us to put the last name first, in other words, in column A, followed by the first name. We want to sort our information across the columns. Here's what we do. First, make sure that we have inserted a blank row. In this case, we want to name the order. We want our last name to come first, followed by our first name. Everything else can remain in order. Address, city, state, and zip code. Now select one cell in the data set. Go up to data, sort. The first thing that we want to do is make sure that we select no header row. This way we'll be able to sort according to our new order. Second step, choose options. In options, choose sort left to right click OK, click OK, and there you have it. We have our last name first, followed by the first name. Now it's a simple matter of just selecting and clearing the information there. Let's go over here and let's rearrange our employee directory. We've been asked to put the department first, followed by the last name, the first name, supervisor, extension, and starting date. Once again, select any cell in the data set. We want to make sure, of course, that we have that blank row just above top. It's a dummy row. Data, sort. Once again, we want to make sure that we select that my data range has no heading rows so we can sort on our dummy row. In options, sort from left to right. Click OK. Click OK. There you have it. There's our new sort order. We can change that order again. What if we want department followed by supervisor, followed by last name, first name, extension, and start date? Once again, one cell in the data set, data, sort. Make sure that we have no header selected and ensure that we have left or right. OK, OK. And there you have it. Now, of course, once we clear out our data set or our dummy row in, on top of our data set, then we can simply go back and we can sort in ascending order. So there you have a great technique for rearranging your data by sorting across the columns. I'll see you in the next lesson.